giving unfair advantage to your own family if you're in a position of power, especially by giving them jobs. That is the Oxford Dictionary's definition of nepotism. Now, the Trump family in America just redefined it. President Donald Trump's daughter, Ivanka Trump, casually gate-crashed the G20 summit in Japan. She made some small talk in a conversation that she was not even a part of, and she sparked a raging debate back home in the U.S. This report tells you more. As soon as you start talking about the economic aspect of it, though, yeah. a lot of people start listening who yeah. wouldn't start otherwise listening. listen. And the same with the defense side of it, yeah. um, in terms of the whole sort of male dominant. That's the president's daughter. She was just, you know, hanging out at the G20 and stuff, having a tete a tete with Teresa. Relaxing in the beautiful city of Osaka in Japan. Ah, oh, the perks of having a powerful papa. And she has the most powerful of all, the president of the US. Then it's only par for the course that she, you know, took a stroll through the meeting of the 20 most powerful leaders in the world with 20 of the biggest economies to boot. While papa was away at work meetings, Trump's little girl was just keeping herself entertained. With some global gossip and diplomacy diddly do. So what if she barged into a conversation with the Prime Minister of the United Kingdom? An embattled and exhausted one who's just counting days before she leaves 10 Downing Street. A world leader who has watched her dream job turn into a Brexit nightmare. However, the fact that Ivanka has no real qualifications to serve as a diplomatic representative of the U.S. and that she hasn't been confirmed by the U.S. Senate for a government position didn't miss the folks back home in the U.S. And they asked the obvious question. What in God's name was she doing there in the first place? They tore into Ivanka on social media when this video clip went viral. Using the hashtag Unwanted Ivanka, people have been posting photoshopped pictures of historic and fictional events that now include Ivanka Trump. And in this clip, Ivanka Trump is seen trying to engage in small talk with a handful of foreign leaders, including France's President Emmanuel Macron and Christine Lagarde, the Managing Director of the International Monetary Fund, who had been nodding while Theresa May spoke and then looked totally dumbstruck by Ivanka's comments. France basically said, oops, because it was they who released the clip in the first place. The French presidency felt a tad awkward and insisted that it didn't anticipate the reaction. Let's be fair, the French government can be blamed for many things, but certainly not this one. In a statement, an official with the Elysee, the French presidential palace said, the French government often releases such clips of moments at summits and this particular one took place in the leaders' lounge right before the sessions on gender equality of which Ivanka was one of the keynote speakers. Empowerment and place Ivanka was probably warming up for her keynote on gender equality except that she was doing it in a completely different conversation about something else altogether. Ivanka Trump made a mockery of a global summit even as she made a fool of herself. The White House, however, didn't think so. A White House official clarified that Japan's Prime Minister Shinzo Abe invited Ivanka to speak at the G20 summit. But still, even they couldn't find an explanation for Ivanka's random little talk. Your report, we on World is One.